We will resume from wherever we left off. I completely forget as to where specifically we left off. But anyway, hello, my dear ones. Welcome to part five of no oh, fatal frame mobile. I mean, so even on this, it says <laughs> like on the Xbox, it's Project Zero, but game that I'm streaming clearly says Fatal Frame. And uh, this is one of those weird things. I mean, I know why it's that because of like region things, but it's, I don't know. Um I have to find a missing person to Like, it really does just kind of seem like, yeah, no, a weird change. Uh, I, again, I kind of have no idea as to specifically where we left off. Or as to what we were actually doing. Doing. Do I have an objective? I have no idea, honestly. Because I know that I used to play this at, like super early in the morning, so. That was mostly because the internet was completely trash. Like, I mean, it's Australian internet. What do you Australian internet? What do you expect? But that was actually was Hong Kong the line. going the right way, I have no idea. <sighs> um. <coughs> like, this must be just completely so uncomfortable having to wade through water. I'll go back to the front. Okay. Am I going that way? Oh, okay. So then... Turn here. Oh, no. I wanted to open the door. Um, and then uh, yeah, yeah. For, uh, okay. So then the only other way is to
Hmm, all right, so it looks like through here. I actually seriously have no idea as to which way I'm supposed to go. <coughs> um, but I guess in some gaming news, I have started to play Persona 5. I know it's probably kind of an old game at this point, but I really... I turned around, didn't I? Yeah, that's a four. Wait. <sighs> I haven't actually played a Persona game for. So, I know there are like several versions of five. Persona 5, Persona 5 Royals, Persona 5 Strikers. I think I'm just playing the base game. But uh, so far it's pretty fun. I am glad that there's a new game plus because I feel like trying to... Okay, so... I guess a good example of this would be Al the Altair franchise. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Altair. In which you do get a limited amount of time. Oh my god, it was the true right where I just was. What the fuck? I seriously just did all that for nothing. Oh, good to know. Okay, I'm a fucking idiot. You feel like no. Um, anyway, the Altai franchise, which is... <sighs> you get a very limited... Time frame to actually do stuff. And there is somewhat of a new game plus mode, which you get to keep a couple stuff, which will help with the next one. But you can't do everything, and you're under like a very. Well, That's kind of creepy. And you're under like a time crunch to actually do them. So, it kind of is just like this big time crunch thing. I don't know. I, I don't really like games specifically with a time crunch. Like, take my, uh, take Majora's Mask. I guess that's a good one. Well, you can kind of do everything at once, but you have to build up to it. For like the constant resetting of towns, oh, time. Oh, shit. Okay, um... <laughs> I 
<laughs> I will perfectly admit I've completely forgotten the controls. No, this is kind of an interesting boss fight. I'll admit, the dolls do look kind of creepy. I hit that just right, but I guess not. going kind of horrible here. I have a health bar, I thought... What the hell is the ghost health bar? Here I thought it was, it was messing up, I was just like... kind of easy. I just honestly kind of messed it up a bit. Uh, yes, put the murder doll back on display. That's, that's going to work.
Nice fucking hidden staircase has opened. Just have to figure out where I need to go. Okay, not that way. Oh, okay. I didn't even know that was there. Much like my home sweet home thing. But this is why I don't go chasing people. Hey, like, so, so. If someone that you know has just completely run off. No explanation. Nope. Don't even bother. Just fuck them. Leave. <gasps> like, seriously. If someone you know has been possessed by an evil spirit, is being chased by an evil spirit, it's just Go on. Fuck them. <sighs> Interesting place for a doll. Like, just really. It's it's not worth it. <sighs> I mean, I should know. I'm an expert. I can see another key for the hole in the wall. The passage appears to be well lit with electrical lights. I've got to sneeze. God damn, it's sneezing. I'm using like incredibly just shitty hand sanitizer gel. Eh, like, it's horrible, but eh. eh. Where does the passage lead to? I'm. You know, why you ask and. Do we know? Nick, see. This is kind of an issue that I've mentioned before with... <clears throat> Stuff like anime sins, and it's just like... Uh, the characters talking to themselves, so... You just... Fear the t isn't this is just uh, 
this is actually. <sighs> it's actually where I just came, isn't it? God damn it. I was just like. Yeah, they're talking to themselves. And it's just like. Yeah, that's a sin. It's just like, oh fucking K, where's the sin? Really? It is so just incredibly stupid. This is like, <coughs> yeah, this is a sin, and it's just like, no, it's not. It's literally just the characters talking. Black box. It's in a hollow along the passage. Can I not open it? And it looks like something I can smash to get stuff out of. It's called a submarine lady. Or if it's too big for that, I don't know, just to patch a couple weights. I don't fucking know. Oh my god, there's a hand in this box. Can I give you a hand? Partially open box submerged in the water. It looks like it's filled with dark water. Can I lend you a hand? <sighs> Do you need to arm up? Oh my god. I don't know if I should know that person. Aruka. Oh, there you go, it's Aruka. I don't know it's Aruka again. <gasps> My dream is to get into a box. That, that box. On the day that only the two of us survived. Excuse me, do you guys have a box to rent? Hmm. Well, that box looks affordable. 500 yen? That's a steal. I actually don't know how much 500 yen is. But it comes with a free creepy dance lady that has a ball of light. That's a bargain. <sighs> Thank you for helping me into the box. <gasps> hey! You said lights out already. I. This is a horrible bath. I am going to sue. Oh my god, she's alive. Hello. I'd like to lodge complete with housekeeping. I mean, just remember, this was censored. <coughs> Which I honestly find kind of funny. I mean, I wouldn't say this is overly sexual or anything, but... 
Oh, come on, I hit that perfect. the whole idea of needing to censor video games just honestly stupid like if it's something all right let's take damn it i'm dead here Let's take something like Mass Effect, the remastered trilogy. Damn it. <clears throat> In which they censored or they changed a couple of scenes so that it doesn't like primarily focus on Miranda's ass. In a couple of them. Bring up the camera. <laughs> then yeah, I can see that being something. I am definitely dead here. However, when it does come... Alright, well she's almost dead too. Something like this, and it's just like... Yeah, to actually see what got centered. Ah, oh, no. I'm dead. Like, the actual censored thing is an endgame costume set. Like... You had to actually complete the game... ...and just... You have to complete the game, actually buy the outfit, then all that, and it's just like... You. I'm Yuri. I was sent here to come and look for you. Can you walk? Come on, let's get out of here. All right. <clears throat> okay, I guess a good example to what I'm... Good example. Let's say it's an R18 movie. Or, you know, MA15+, plus, as this game is MA15+. Alright. And then... Post-credit scene... There's... A topless chick. Alright. Sense that shit. Alright, that, that's, that's essentially it. You had to... Buy the movie. You have to be old enough to buy a ticket for the movie, or old enough to buy the movie. It's post credit, so you had to actually watch the entirety of the fucking movie, and then actually watch that scene. But the, you see as to how stupid. That sounds. <clears throat> oh, 
But like... Uh, people are gonna be fucking idiots regardless. Seriously, what... What is the point of centering a game that... Like... You can literally... The person who asked you to come find me. <coughs> you can literally look up naked yes, yoga yes. on YouTube. Alright. Actually, let's let's live. This is my reaction. Let's let's have a look. YouTube, which I'm pretty sure you need a. I mean, you can easily fudge. Your birthday on YouTube. Literally. Naked yoga and oh look at that. I mean just these thumbnails. Oh look that person completely naked. Completely naked. The thumbnails. Oh, actually worse. <laughs> I, I, I like this title. Sex, porn, nude, yoga, naked news, ASMR, sex, video, porno, triple X, blue film, and it's just like the thumbnails. Freaking worse than anything that would have been in this fucking game. So it's just like Like do you see how pointless that is? It actually... No. No, because like, it's even bloody worse. Because you look at it from this way. <clears throat> you have to buy the console first. Right? Buy the console first. That's like what? Several hundred bucks. Buy the game. Give me. <clears throat> and then do it that way. As I say. Why did I? Do you just see how? Utterly kind of stupid that sounds. <sighs> like, yeah, okay. That's it. Uh, it really. I'm going the wrong way. Damn it. Ah, what the fuck? God damn it. Please. Dollar. Like it was that just kind of like a jump scare or do I actually need to go down that way? Sorry. 
it's too late now, lady. Did I say to walk, uh, go, yeah, yes. <sighs> now you're suddenly full of energy, huh? I must kill the ball every shine maiden. I can't stand the fucking eyes. I keep staring at them out, gouging them out. After they've seen too much, yeah, fucking bastards. I saw my deviant art fan fiction. No, I'm not actually speaking of on deviant art. No, it's not like this way. I completely forget as to like what one it was, but. Bitch, really. Um, but it was a fairly decent Mass Effect one. <sighs> Get out of here with your edgelord bullshit. Well, totally dissolved together. Probably don't mind if I just use your head there. I see you are a lot easier to deal with than the other one. Oh, so like, totally cars to control. Oh, wait, yeah, no, it was the other guy that had, like, the mask. Quick flash thing. Bash out, cut you. Oh shit, I'm out of. I was out of film. Okay. No, no, that that was embarrassing. You can no. Nope. <laughs> oh, oh, that was actually embarrassing. I I can't believe I died because I didn't check the film. Cute. Um, what's cute? The knife? Yeah, I think cute, though.
the woman. Eh. Which one? The dead one or the alive one? No, dead. Eh. Not too bad, I guess. Look at your head in the frame, it kind of is an extra little security thingy. Yeah, I'm not running out of film this time. I honestly was trying to figure out, like, what was that incredibly quick four-time attack, and then I just remembered it was the other guy. What were you doing there? I wanted to see a box. I saw the setting sun. It we didn't have any boxes I was where I live. a part of it, as if I were melting. Well, what's important is that you're back. Miracle, you're not hurt. Where is Fuyuhi? Huh? Be she dead. Is she here? No, she dead. Hear a song. That song. Bish dead. Haruka, please. Just try and get some rest for now, okay? I lock you in, she dead. Right. Thank you. <laughs> Um, Hoka, better give her some time to recover to tell when and Ryu about Ahsoka. Uh, so I guess in a bit of gaming news, Cryopod seriously just make Ark, like, so much easier. Sorry to intrude. I just spoke with Mr. Hojo. He agreed that we should come by as often as we can to Miss Kurosawa gets back. Having someone be there for you can be a huge comfort at times like this. Okay. Cheese Karuna Blueberry. Oh, I did not. Uh, is there a zoom feature on this? Uh, I can't actually tell what's being offered here.
but whatever it is, it's, um, cheese, does that seriously say cheese banana? <laughs> like, uh, does it, blueberry, mother milk, I need answers, what does that say? Because, to me, cheese uh, hanana? I don't think it's cheese hanana. But, is it cheese banana? I, I don't want to know what a cheese banana tastes like, but, I mean, if they're offering it for like a thousand yen, sure. Oh, cheese, banana, blueberry, buttermilk. Where's this cheese, banana? Pure tea. Cookies. Extra cookie. Is that... Does that really say cookies, extra cookie? Okay, now we know I don't personally enjoy some extra cookie. Pure tea. Cookies, extra cookie. No cheese, banana, regular coffee. That's a lot of regular coffee. <sighs> no one should have that amount of regular coffee. Imagine coming into an antique store that doubles as like an investigation place just for cookies with extra cookie. It's like, yes, I would like some extra cookies with my cookie. No, for no, for no reason. Just for the fact that I don't fucking know. <sighs> Do you know where your boss is? No, okay. In here, I'm assuming. Oh. Must be having a terrible nightmare. It would be a shame to wake him up. Touch. Just be down that ghost. Okay. Like, oh my god, dude. Totally dreaming of ben, dead kids. It's time. We'll leave now. You should get some rest. I know. Night. I know. I just don't wanna. <sighs> Imagine taking this hat into the bath. Like, really. Imagine just going for a bath and then. Oh, no, no, dude, the hat's ruined now. Come on, it's ruined. It's ruined. Now it's definitely ruined. 
Now, here. I didn't auto a box. Oh, hey, a roommate. What oh, no fucking shit. Don't have to be that much of an ass about it. It's just like seriously, that hat is ruined. Why? Why would you take a hat into the bath? You crazy! Uh, a dream. It was like the memory I saw when I touched Haruka in the cave. I need to know more. Maybe if I ask her? And maybe if I hope that she didn't run away because she's a side character? And side characters in Fate of Fighting games really have a pension for just fucking off. I would love to be in Japan where it's just perpetually raining. Apparently. Is she on the top floor or bottom floor? So directly down this way. Yep. She's gone. What a fucking shock. Like, honestly, why I'm not surprised. I'm sure I would love to see Yoke's question. <sighs> and this is why you lock up crazy bitches in the room. He finds the missing Haruka Momose and the reliquy in a cave beneath the shrine of dolls. She takes the girl back to the shop, who is in no state to talk and can't explain what happened to her. That night, Hoka is visited by Fuyuhi's ghost, who takes her back to the mountain because fuck you! This is why we can't have nice things. Uh, anger rank. Not too horrible. Probably could have gone a bit better during a couple of the fights, but... Uh, that's the only one that I have been ranking. Let's see... It would be nice if we could actually see... ...them before buying them. That is still a horrible swimsuit. <laughs> um. 
Like, I'm not sure if... It's just because the censored thing, but that is horrible. Uh, I mean, you really don't have much to do right now, do you? I guess that one's a bit better because you can actually see. But for that one, it's just like, eh. prefer the white one over the black one though. Like, I don't know, the white one kind of looks a bit better. Writings who found at Ichu Manor, when learns of the folklore who lived at Mount Hikami, when sits out to the unfathomable forest to see if the rumors of a disappearing house are true. White is better, yeah. I agree, the white one looks better. For players who want to enjoy the game, I mean, that is, that is really, ju like, that is, that is false. <sighs> if people want to enjoy the game, playing it on the easiest setting, that is how they enjoy it. Sure, a very easy is more used for the story. But, the saying it's for those who want to enjoy the game. Um, I mean, I have the points for it, so I may as well. Oh wait, no, that's my count. Oh, that's my. Okay. I was just like, I have a crap ton of points, but then I just realized I don't. <sighs> oh, hey, look. It's another box. In the course of their investigation, Ren and Rui learn of Keiji Watawe folklore who settled on Mount Hikami. His writings are certain to be a treasure trove of information about the mountain and its particular folklore. Ren and Rui happen across a videotape that may just indicate the way to Watawe's residence. Because it's not like we can use Google Maps on a mountain.
Yuhi took her own life and while we attempted suicide, the ghost of the Shrine Maiden appeared on both occasions. Yuhi spoke of a black box she found Hoka trapped in. Does the key to all these events lie in the mountain's dark past? Folklore, Keiji Watari used to live there. His notes may shed some light on this mystery. The video table we found on the desk, it seems to be related to that folklore. I should take a look at it. Videotape and some notes on the desk, they seem related to Mount Akami. I've got to go upstairs. I'm on the second floor now. something. The running commentary on this is really good. Is there a third floor? I don't know. Is there? I mean. Like, see, this would make sense if she was on the phone to someone. Looks but... Like it's the attic. This is... <gasps> handwriting along with commentary on the video. Oh no! Who knew that there'd be something spooky up there? <sighs> the diary mentioned... Folk also lived on Mount Kami, found more information including his names and books in the occult. 
The folk ghost, Keiji Watai, went to the mountain due to his obsession with the mysteries of, mysteries of the sect living there. He went missing, as mentioned in his diary. Rumors about what happened to him abound. They say he didn't just die or go missing, but rather stumbled onto something the mountain wanted to keep hidden. And so his entire house was sold up by the mist. This is the origin of the one of Mount Hikami's more recent stories of a haunted mansion. Haunted house, I should say. Oh, the brassy. Oh, it's so clear. I looked into a videotape left behind by someone who stumbled across this house. The video is apparently famous in occult circles. I contacted the publisher and received the following response. Dear Uwe Kage yum 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 yum. Thank you for counting that. Us. The video we were looking for is no longer in print, but there are still some copies in our warehouse. The video prompted a huge amount of feedback from customers. This tape was f uh, the tape was found on a river near Mount Hikami. Uh, it is unknown who filmed it. There are many sections too damaged by water to be usable, and so we took what was left and edited it together. The master copy of the video was confiscated by the police. Uh, they conducted a search of the mountain but were unable to find who shot the film. <sighs> or even the house's location. Now that entering the forbidden unfathomable forest is prohibited. We advise you look into this on your own. Oh, you not. Koi Koji Kakamoto Sugentia Film Division. I believe the building visible at the start of the video is a shrine of dolls. After that, we see what seems to be a cave, but it's hard to make anything out. From the number of books seen in the house, it is likely that it is really the former house of Keiji Watari. Ren speaking. Ren. Kazuya. I've been trying to get in touch with you. I was worried. Listen, about what I said to you before. I'm getting married. What? You are? Yeah. That's... wow. Um, congratulations. Uh, and who's the lucky bride? Anyone I know. Ever since... I saw her picture. Will you die with me? I'm going to shine those into a cave. That's maybe the same what you were talking about. These look to be Rui's notes. Maybe she dropped them. I wonder if it's okay to read this. Mr. Hojo often cries out in his sleep. He won't tell me much, but he seems like he has a recurring dream about a cemetery. From his a ceremony from his childhood. As a young boy, Mr. Hojo said he spent a lot of 
or some of relative to the base of Mount Kagoi. It's mentioned playing in an old house and in a shrine on the mountain. It's some kind of festival he went to? Mr. Hojo doesn't want to talk about his past much. So what he has told me. I remember clearly. Is he dreaming of that ceremony? I went to festivals as a child, but I remember having a good time. It doesn't sound like the festival Mr. Hojo dreams about is any fun. He often cries, don't look at me in his sleep. He always has a hard time with people staring at him. He especially dislikes it when women look at him for too long. He won't even look Miss Kurosawa or Miss Kurosawa in the eye sometimes. He doesn't have a mis issue with me though. Are the women he's dreaming of really that frightening? I mean. If she just he leaves it there, then... He was helping you look for post-mortem photographs, wasn't he? He went missing. I'm just glad to know he's still alive. I'm probably going to save up to get that. Shadow with the cold, it gets so quiet at night. I mush and not to hold your 55. Moves as a soul here, but he feels like a week, a week, feels like it could go a year. I don't know when they know that's so true. I am trying to sleep. Bitch, step off. At last. You are a man, are you not? I'm a girl. Liar. I, I am. I see. In that case, let us play. This is an effigy of you. No, I'll make you into an effigy. Could you not kidnap my assistant, please? God damn it, kids. 
What was that? Willie, where did you go? <coughs> Do the right thing in my life. I take care of my house, my picket fence, my children, and my wife. Oh, 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 Way home, clock is old, here I go. To anyone that hasn't actually listened to Hilltop Hoods, good band. Oh. For hip hop artists, honestly, there is a very different between Australian and American. Australian is actually good. Hey, I got you to do the right thing in my life. Take care of my house, my picket fence, my children, and my wife. Oh, 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 oh. Clock is old, here I go. The children are playing. Sometimes I wake up at night feeling their presence. The throwing moon doors. Those that I know have been put away have been moved somewhere else. From what happens, the more clearly I hear the sounds of playing. The more often I have dreams when I'm among the children play, <gasps> play with them. I can't make out the children clearly, but I think my late daughter was one of them. Last night, it felt like I was being watched. I walked to find a white haired girl staring at me. She said, Don't worry, your daughter's playing with a doll. You fixed after that. You should have spared. Those eyes, it's like she could see everything. She even seemed to answer my query question that was on my mind. <sighs> you so beautiful. Times I feel I make a mess of things. Life can be so beautiful. Scale is a perfect 999 out of 10. He captivates, so the twinkle in his eyes, you know that hugs the weight. That tickles as a chance to bring you happiness. I'm so obsessed over and over again. Small are just a monster to me. He is everything I want and the best son I need. Could you not love him at all? Forever and ever. Huh? What? Be on hell one day. But I keep on hoping you'll be okay. Ever, ever grow up for me. How are you? Are they kind of your singing cutest too? Can I hold on to you before you have to come to our rescue? The Scarlet King has apocalyptic songs to sing. Dreadful day will bring sovereign into suffering. 
I'm missing a lullaby to you. Can we hide off from the two? Can we hold you close and never let you go? The monster to me, he's everything I want and the best friend I need. How could you not love Rui. him? You... you really came for me. Of course I did. You... you alright? Yeah. You're like the c second cute assistant that I have. We seems to be okay. I have to find a way to the veiled house. He always said there's an entrance to the cave below the door display in the front shrine. Sometimes I get more lost than my sister, and I was just like, okay, which way was the way back? <sighs> Why do I get the feeling that there's something in that room? Maybe it's just me, but fuck it. Mel Mel. I over and over again, gee, it's all the finally meet to other friends. And I heard your story, don't really like how it ends. Gee, it's all the finally meet to other friends. What did you say about me? What did you say? What did you do about me? What did you do? Did you play games about me? What did you play? I think of the time that I won't find out about you. I saw her heart the story over and over again. Gee, it's sort of finally meet her all the Okay, I'll admit, this guy looks creepy. I moves all the game, didn't know you were playing. Another game, this time I got to win. Life on the line, where it go? Ready or not, let's begin. Outside, I've heard the story over and over again. Gee, it's so to finally meet her lover friends. I heard the story, don't really like how it ends. Gee, it's so to finally meet her lover friends. Yeah, I'm not really much of a fan of Steven Universe future. I used to really enjoy Steven Universe. I remember specifically on Facebook actually being part of a group and they used to like upload the episode as it came out. And yeah. I kind of lost interest in it after the hiatuses were just so fucking long. And it's just like, Gaka. The movie? Eh, the movie was okay. I will admit though, I am a fan of Spinel, the antagonist. But I kind of like. Her design, she reminds me of Peacock from Skullgirls. You found me. You are the girl.
You didn't keep it with you. Yep. For a crazy killer ghost girl. My token. Hmm. She's kind of cute. Did you lose it? But our promise. Then again, I do kind of have a thing for white hair. Like, not old person white hair, but you know what I mean. Yes? What? What? <clears throat> so, I'm not really sure if the whole I'm a girl, but the child saying liar is, I'm not sure if that person's supposed to be trans, I could be, I don't think it is. But I mean, she could pass for a male. She is what? Oh, I'm assuming she is cute. Like, she could pass for a male, given just a bit of work. But I'm, I'm gonna always just say this. A good use of like an agendered character in media. That I've seen recently is definitely opera from uh, Damn it. Opera from Welcome to Demon School. You off. In which, any time that you see opera, they pretty much have, um, like, from when they're in school, they have male and female outfits on. Like, I think a female shirt, or, you know, I think it was a male shirt, female... Pants, I don't know. But, Oppa, good example of a character whose gender you have no idea what the fuck they are. <sighs> but, um, instead of focusing on that. You, you know, I've been waiting. Twitter would like to. So, um. I've been waiting. I kind of turned to watch your hey and the other guy. No, go on. But like complaining about a woman a drawing being unrealistic. And it's just like. Japanese people do have big boobs, yeah. Like, I mean, some of them can. Obviously, not all. Like, just look at Keiho. I'm not sure if Keiho has any work done. But. So, for context, um, they were complaining about the body proportions being unrealistic. And then complaining that she was taken to like a cheap diner or something.
Oh, I swear, people at Twitter really just seem like they want to complain about something. Oh yeah, you took a screenshot of Nezuko in her adult form. Mm. Gotta cancel. Took a image of a fictional demon girl. Goddamn. That was completely my bad. Or, hell, even Darky, which, you know, it's just like, yeah, nope, 113 years old, yeah, too young. <sighs> People on Twitter are fucking idiots. was the option to get her then? I mean, there, obviously, but still. Son, I heard the story over and over again. Do you sort of finally meet her other friends? What are you even saying? I'm a loser of the game. You didn't know you were playing. Not a game this time, I'm the twin. Left the line, would have took God, and not let's begin. Over and over again, gee, so to finally meet her, all her friends. Gee, so to finally meet her, all her friends.
this is good box. It come right free. Even come with free ride into water. Sort of finally meet her other friends. I heard the story, don't really like how it ends. G, it sort of finally meet her other friends. Say about me, what did you say? What did you do about me? What did you do? Did you play games about me? What did you play? I swear, yeah. I was gonna say, I did see an item over here. Oh, that. of the game you I didn't know you were playing. This time I'm about to win. Life in the line, what it takes already or not, let's begin. Over and over again. Gee, it's sort of funny meet her other friends. Could you like totally not attack my assistant, please? Okay, so that was back on here. I guess the name, the one behind it all. It's gone, I'm howling at the moon, I'm sipping in the middle of a southern afternoon. To make it take go away. Is it even here or? I have no idea.
It wouldn't be that one. Suck a living out of space Cause as soon as I'm stuck in time Make you ride through the line In the shadow with the cold Get to quiet at night Like Marshall North could hold your 55 We could go for the kick Go a year From my no one near enough I miss so true But don't tell them where I'm from I tell them where I'm close to map and you're still sideways and chipping like I'm back but that's just fine it's a half and I'm happy living in the city that is trapped in time come no panic by chance I'm back in time for a TV dinner on another night so someone will fly map my map is on pump never get a mention by the way and then some once again, the old men on the bench. Um. Have a saying, I don't want to be alive. I live in our space because it seems I'm stuck in time. It's like a boy jeep. Thank you for telling me that's for the door literally right here. I never would have guessed. Where I go, where I go, so I'll always be home. Matter. It's the failed house. I need more film. Oh, wait, no, it's a uh, film right here, but it might be. Yeah, 24. Not bad. Go live in outer space, cause it seems I'm stuck in time. It's like we ride for life. It gets so quiet at night. Like, martial law to hold your 55. God damn it. Smoke trail spins forward to cloud the room so it's only him you feel as it moves forward. I'm right, pushing it forward, what it wouldn't give for it. You see, it's put in their places. Focus forward. Ah! See, again, if it was just me trying to sing the lyrics and actually seeing the lyrics, sure. Damn it. I'd be a lot better. <sighs> trying to actually combine it with gameplay, and no. I 
I'm me a black sego. Just let me burn, catch fire and burn, catch fire and burn. Strike a spark and ignite it in the dark. So we're not no more. I was here before, so let me just burn. me up like a cigarette and just let me burn catch fire and burn catch fire and burn try to spark and ignite it in the dark so when I'm no more no I was here before so let me just burn I'm already watching that Netflix show you wanted. It's horrible. Kazuya? Damn it. Really? I wanted to watch him? that. This is just like like that picture you were looking at. Kazuya. Damn it, what was that song called? I don't know what it was what it called, I just forget the bloody artist. Illy. And it was called Pictures, of course. Uh, this is exactly the same picture from that photo album. Did Kazuya come here because of it too? God damn it, Kazuya. You came here for some ghost butt, didn't you? It's like, oh, yep, my ghost wife was here. Change of plan, I can you all take my head Oh, young will lie, just in the memories, not enough time So I keep a picture in my wallet of you You, 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 you Change of plan, I can you all take my head Oh, young will lie, just in the memories, not enough time so I leave a picture in my wallet of uh, you, 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 you. Blamo. So I leave a picture in my wallet of you. Making me want to take my hair. We young, we're alive, chasing the memories, not enough time.
Let me touch you. God damn it, I'm being mugged by ghosts again, ball. is the worst stage types ever. You're supposed to catch him. Suck at a concert. I'm the outsider. That's why I speak good spiders. Spit on my diet chart and synthesize the life is a video game play. Claim that some cane. But can I just open shit without you? Trying to grope me. I'm thick skinned, I'm still trying to the end stock to a Nasus. Say lightning, don't strike twice in the same place see your life. I paid the price, sticking their advice. This is a really somewhat old song. But like very underrated which is Donkey Kong Suicide by the Melodics. The Melodics band under two hundred subscribers, forty three K views. But like that Damn, does it slap. Same with Take Me Away, that has less, and I would argue that's a better song. 17k views. <sighs> Teacups and tobacco upon a dusty table. But I say, take me away. I'm sick of the day. Please take me away. In the UFO, I'm so out of this place. Don't you let me go. Please take me away. In the UFO, I'm so out of this place. Don't you let me go. Sometimes I'll cup and pray. I don't know what to do, but I say. I'm gonna skip the day. Please take me away. And you will fall. I'm so tired of this place. Won't you let me go?
Alright, I'll be calling it once the next checkpoint pops up. What are you pointing at? The first from away. Post mode of photography made its way over from the west along with the spread of the camera. When photography was still wet, images of the deceased helped the surviving grieving surviving member family members deal with their grief. The postmodern photographers that photographs that photographs that still exist in Japan use the same methodology as the Western counterpart, but the significance seems to differ. It was taken here at Mount Kami. Especially seemed to embody a sort of me melancholic beauty. I believe these photos were the work of the scientist named Kunihiko Aso. Having researched photos from other areas as well, it seems he was the only one he was the one behind many of them. His surviving records the indicated the determination to use photography to catch the soul. Seeing these strange and captivating photographs, I have come to believe he had some degree of success in doing so. An old friend of mine used to call cameras lonely boxes. I'm not sure if he meant that the subject appears to be trapped alone in this dark box when viewed for the viewfinder, or that looking for the viewfinder meant peering out with the dark all alone. At any rate, I find these works I find these words for certain residents. <sighs> <laughs> God damn it, you really did just come here to get a ghost wife. My ghost wife is waiting for me. The waters of this mountain are beautiful. A large volume of water flows from a lake at the summit. Becoming rivers and waterfalls and enveloping the mountain in mist. Water covers everything. It is a source of the mountain's beauty as well as its sense of mystery. According to local tradition, Mount Hikami is where one could die a proper death. It has long been considered a spiritual spot and the subject of much worship, making it a righteous destination for those seeking death. The Mount Hikami sect taught me that upon dying, people would turn to water. Here in the mountain, water is considered the source of the soul. A person's soul is said to be said to return to water upon death, rather than moving to the afterlife. Those ready for death would gather at the mountain and return their lives to the water. Water connects everything. To look at this scenery, I can understand how it has become a spiritual place for those seeking 
of those. A place fit for passing from this world. I'm glad I came here. The people in this mountain have a yearning for death. That is to say, they have a yearning for water and a yearning for nature. Life and death, both connected by water. Suicide. I saw the silhouette of a shrine, shrine maiden from within the mist that envelops the mountain. With great care, she made her way slowly up the mountain. Something about her seemed unnatural. I've been told there are no more shrine maidens on the mountain now. Long ago, many maidens were murdered here. Perhaps they returned to the water. What does that imply they are trapped within the mist? Well, that's a fair point. said human sacrifice was once practiced for this region. Rather than returning people to water upon death, the ritual involved placing so-called pillars in special reliquies and sending them to the water while they were still alive. It was the role of shrine maidens to become such pillars. They would take on the memories of the dying and thereafter return to water themselves. Doing so, it was believed the subjects would continue living on as pillars. In Japan, there was once a sect of Buddhist monks who would inter themselves in boxes buried underground for the sake of enlightenment. Those monks were said to show they were still alive by ringing bells and chanting. The practice may related. But what did these maidens who became pillars fear or hope to appease? There are various teachings in Japan about where the afterlife, also known as the Neverworld or the Hereafter, is located. Some teachings say it's in the mountains or across the sea. Other claims it lies underground within the very earth itself. Here on the mountain, it is said to lie within the water and playing a close link between water and death. The pillars within the reliquies would be in a place close to death but would go on living. Perhaps it was spiritual reliquies that allowed them to evade death and continue living. Always in time. It is said that perpetuating these pillars allowed those close to live, close to death, live long lives. In a sense, it was believed that proximity to death helped develop a resistance to it. Ren. That doesn't sound creepy at all. Uh, 
Ah! I'll admit, I'm not a fan of these. Ooh, take the sword, dude. Please don't take a pie. I don't know how to, but I say. I'm kind of sick of the day. Please take me away in the UFO. I'm so tired of this place. Don't you let me go. Take me away in the UFO. Won't you let me go? In the UFO. I'm so tired of this place. Won't you let me go? There's gonna be a jump scare wax style, isn't there? I see you. Hey, what's up, dude? Draw some cookies. The, the ghost left behind a notebook. Mount Kami seems to have been both revealed and feared as a mountain of death. Only those prepared to die may enter, and those who visit were never allowed to leave. Visitors in the mountain had to pass through the shrine. Go over the foot of the mountain. The shrine maidens kept strict watch and allowing only the qualified, that is, the dying, to enter. Today, the shrine at the Gulf has been rebuilt as an inn. In kind innkeepers kind of let me borrow records of the time period. The record on the shrine's final year. This one individual who was able to leave the mountain alive. Kunihiko Aso, after taking his postmortem photographs, it seems he was invited to the mountain to photograph to photograph the maidens. Why am I having such a hard time with photographs? I heard his research into... I heard of his research into the hereafter. Also helped him to develop a special camera. If I could see these photos of the Shrine Maidens taken with a special camera, I'm certain I could come close to unraveling the mysteries of Mount Hikami. When invited to the mountain, it was said he was allowed into a house, visited only by a select few. If I were invited to the mountain too, would I be able to reach this place too? I truly wish I could. This is pouring into the wound. That's not a good sign. I, I am going to call it here. I hope everyone enjoyed. I will see you all later. Bye bye for now.